where the Taliban are marking one year of their rule. A turbulent year that saw the erosion of women's rights, the resurgence of terror groups and the worsening of a humanitarian crisis. On the 15th of August 2021, the Taliban captured Kabul. It was a lightning offensive that saw cities across the country fall one by one. The Taliban marked last year's victory with small-scale celebrations, but for ordinary Afghans, the group's return has only increased hardships. The country is struggling with rising poverty, drought, malnutrition and fading hope among the women. The establishment of the Islamic Emirate triggered an international response. Aid stopped coming in, foreign reserves were frozen, sanctions hit the new regime and since then the economy has nosedived. And this was followed by a humanitarian crisis. The economy shrank by over 30% as household income slipped below the poverty line. Roughly 25 million Afghans are now living in poverty. The UN estimates that up to 900,000 jobs could be lost this year. We are now one year down the line from the Taliban takeover and we're witnessing incredibly high levels of poverty in the country. Uh, this is due to the economic uh, collapse of the country, uh, which is well documented. Uh, we're seeing people uh, with their salaries reduced, with their income reduced, uh, taking on greater debt, um, using coping strategies, uh, which include early marriage for girls, child labor, um, it's an extreme situation. As for women, 20 years of progress has been wiped out in just a year. The Taliban have cracked down on women's rights, dictating where they can go, what they can do and what they can wear. Thousands of girls have been shut out of secondary schools, while women have been barred from returning to their jobs. Truly, during this one year, negative changes have been made in the lives of all Afghans, especially for women, and I'm one of them. I have been prevented from work in everything. Most of the days, I feel sad and feel bad. Currently, no country has officially recognized the new Taliban government, but for Taliban, the joy of victory overshadowing the current economic crisis. They are celebrating a year of their rule in Afghanistan, yet even that cannot mask the scale of the challenge that the Taliban face. With no immediate fix in sight for spiraling prices, rising joblessness and hunger. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.